what we always say is a, as a caveat, this is a foundational level class. Um, this is gonna give you the information to, to, to literally keep you out of jail. To, as they say, keep you on the right side of the law. Um, we, it's not that we were trying to reinvent the wheel or do something bigger, better. It was just, we wanted something different. Um, you cannot be a convicted felon in the, in the state of Arizona as well as the United States and possess own uh, firearms okay, or ammunition on a federal statute unless your rights have been reinstated. So that means your conviction has been expunged, set aside, vacated, whatever the, the terminology in that state is at. So just because you get a felony conviction doesn't mean your life is over. Um, a good friend of ours named Thomas Yoxel, he was the guy, the gentleman that saved Trooper Anderson's life on I-10 and Tonopah a couple in 2017. Guy was attacking, guy was attacking a, a trooper, DPS trooper. Thomas was on his way to Disneyland of all places. He had his firearm, right? He decided he wanted to have his firearm for self-protection from Phoenix to the California border, right? So then he had his firearm and Trooper Anderson got shot by our suspect um, in the shoulder, blew his shoulder out with a rifle round. The guy was on top of Trooper Anderson bludgeoning him and he was trying to grab the trooper's gun to, to finish him off. Thomas stops, gets out of the car, says, officer, do you need help? Yes, I need help. So he goes back to his car, grabs his firearm, points it at the suspect and says, get off the trooper, doesn't comply and he shoots him six times, hits him five times. Suspect goes down, he subsequently dies, and Trooper Anderson now gets to enjoy his life with his family. Can you reasonably expect that if you're carrying a firearm, you're held to a different standard than a person that doesn't? Yes, okay? You are held to a different standard, okay? Um, the class was much more interesting than I thought it would be. Josh has this way of infusing knowledge and humor, and uh, yet it's very serious. It's a very serious subject, so it was, it was quick. I feel like I know so much more, and I'm better prepared to go forward in my training.